Greetings, Internet, and all points beyond. Ah, I am Evil Sidekick, also known to a few as Ethan, and I am here with my first ever Let's Play. Now, I am about to play a game called Pokemon Shiny Gold, which is basically... Okay, it's going to loop back. It's okay. It's going to loop back around. Which is basically, this game is a fan-made game that utilizes, it's basically a fan hack of Pokemon Fire Red, and uses Fire Red's code as the basis to recreate, to create a remake, a third-gen remake, of Pokemon, uh, Pokemon Gold, the second-gen game. So this was actually made in 2006, I believe, before before Heart, Gold, and Soul Silver came out, and I've chosen to play this for a couple reasons. First, I I, I like visual I, I like Visual Boy Advance for emulators. I am doing it on an emulator, but I um, for emulators, and I honestly Pokemon Heart Gold just doesn't emulate very well. I do own the game. I do own every almost like Pokemon games from every generation. I'm not I'm not a strict pirate. I, I do buy the games and then I use the emulators sometimes when I want to use the tools that they have to just do new things. Anyway, uh, anyway, so Shiny Gold is a pretty faithful recreation, it would seem, of Pokemon Gold, and I'm gonna I'm just gonna jump right in. Ah. Uh, there we go. So as you might have noticed there, uh, things get a little bit faster when I hold the space button. Your mom is so fat she eats children for breakfast and lunch. What? Did, did this game just bully me? How? Okay, yeah, anyway. Yeah, as you can see here, I did create a save file already. That you was so distracted. That was weird. That was weird. Anyway, that new game, I guess. Various problems will be explained. So as you can, I'm just going to speed through that. Brazil. Okay. First, from the author. This hack has been st since this hack has been stolen previously. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Apparently, this is actually a a ROM hack that someone once took and put onto actual cartridges to sell. So the which the original author had nothing to do with, so he's very, very, uh, wants to make it very clear nowadays that it is not, he is not, does not endorse that kind of piracy and that kind of fraud. He's just doing this as a fan-made project for fans to play. Hello, sorry to keep you waiting. Hello, welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Fraud. Hi, creatures called Pokemon. You know, sometimes I've seen I've seen videos and pictures of sometimes the Pokemon that uh that gets sent out in the opening credits here will be calculated and be generated as a shiny Pokemon or one of the alternate palette ones. When it's like that is that is such a rare occurrence to happen at all for it to happen during a, a, a literally the, the only cutscene in the game just is brutal. But yeah, anyway, uh, don't have any Pokemon yet. They're still a little bit about yourself. Are you a boy? Are you a boy, or are you a girl? Well, no, 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 no. I'm a boy. Just any of See, look at that. See, there's so in third, third gen pixel level graphics, third third gen level graphics. Uh, we were recreating second gen stuff. And fun fact about the protagonist of the second gen Pokemon games: the, the canonical name of the protagonist in the second gen games is Gold, and his alternate pr pr name, his his actual possibly a human name name, is Ethan, the same as mine. So we will actually. There uh, we go. Well, I do not shout my name anymore. Yes, I am ready. Oh, here you That's interesting. It's giving me the same spiel as the Fire Red, but I know for a fact that it does the... This is weird. Zell. Neo. Dash. Silver. Mm, what do I want to name the rival? I'll something original. You know what we're gonna name him? 
I don't know if this will stick. Oh, no, you know what? No, no, you know what? We're gonna name this one Zell, because I have a feeling that this uh, rival does not appear in the actual game, so I don't want to waste the, the name that I just thought of for my rival on him. Uh, that's just a remnant of it being a fire red hack. Okay. Oh, uh. Come on. Yes. So there may be times when you hear the audio scramble, like that, and that's actually because using because it's being I'm running this game in Visual Boy Advance, I can hold the spacebar to make the game go turbo, and allows me to walk really fast and like here's normal speed and here's with turbo. Yeah. Ah, there's that potion that's in a lot of the games. Okay. Oh, you know what? Option. Why has that ever been a question? Of course you want the text speed fast. Well, style. <coughs> Shift or set. You know what? You know what? Man mode up. We're gonna go man mode up and use the set battle style. Where is our neighborhood? Our neighborhood. Our neighbor, Professor Elm, was looking for you. He said he wanted to use you. Oh, I almost forgot. I your respect. Okay. Oh! What? <laughs> oh, the beauties of fan hacks. Or because this is this game thinks that it's like Pokemon Fire Red, the VS Seekers have the Pokemon here. Okay, so we don't actually have the... I wonder if we'll be given the map then at some point for the map function, because the Poke Gear usually handles the map and the map functions and long-range match call, match call, so... Are you here? Yeah, okay, so you're... Okay, so see, this is a lovely little... Like, look at this. This is well... This is actually pretty well coded, I would say. Pretty well put together. Yeah. Of course, and it looks like it looks it looks exactly like what it promises. Third, second gen Pokemon game, third gen graphics. Uh, favorite acquaintance called. I'm assuming that most of you actually know this story. By the way, I'm just gonna skip most of this text because because uh, quite frankly, it, it, we haven't we all heard this. I mean, yeah. Let's see. I don't, I don't know who I want for my story. I don't know if I want Turtle or. I'm, I'm torn, because, on the one hand, there's there are obvious better, <laughs> better choices, and obviously a uh, worse choice, but at the same time, I kind of want to do something that I wouldn't normally do. I'm, I was considering doing a Nuzlocke run for the longest time, but I've decided against that, because I... I in the Facebook post I used to have people vote on to determine what I would do for some Let's Play, no one actually me I, I mentioned Nuzlocke and no one voted for it, so... What do I want Toted out? I don't usually go with Toted out. I usually go with... I usually go with, uh... with Cyndaquil, like, every time. So yeah, you know what? Toted out. What just oh again see because it thinks it's another game it thinks it's fire red it it did the thing where the pokeball disappears was that it, it maybe wait a minute yeah no 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 okay so you give me potions and now you won't get out of my way that's a little bit of a... there's just little things oh my goodness oh that's the big question this game thinks it's a third gen game, but it it's basically a second basically a second gen game in function. Who are you? Whoa! What? Okay, here's one the first major difference I guess. Um the 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 website for Shiny Gold did mention that it does have a few variations from gold version. It has, you know, same Johto region, same basic gold plot, but there are a few things, and including, as it said, new and different recurring characters. So I guess this is one of those. Pokemon trainer? Question mark? Oh, what kind of thing is this? Is it supposed to be a lab assistant? Or does it just think it's cool to wear a trench coat? I don't know. Squirtle? Whoa! 
Huh. That's weird. Oh well, let's let's stomp him. With scratching power! really weird to have just a new button. It's, that's, that's actually also another reason I chose this over just playing straight up gold. Um, aside from when using the turbo function on Game Boy Color cartridges in a, in a ROM, it'll speed it up to like 50 times the speed because that's how fast, it just goes as fast as your computer can make it go. And so doing so makes my computer just go to 50 times, it makes the game run 50 times the speed and gives me a massive migraine and like eye strain, like medical damage. Um, so I did choose a GBA thing instead, where I could also just play gold, because that's what everyone wanted. But, uh, also it's nice to have just a slightly different, it's a different experience. You know what, this is not the same game that we've all played a million times. Even though it basically is. I'm Carlos. Okay, Carlos. I don't know what your deal is, or what your problem is, but pleasure doing... Pleasure beating you. Horribly. All right, uh, it's amazing. I'm just gonna turbo through most of these like, whoa, critical hit. Okay. I'm just gonna turbo mo through most of the uh, random encounters that I do because it speeds things up. And it's oh my goodness. It is Pokemon. It is Switch Air. That was kind of a gamble. Ugh. Already? Really? I guess I have two of them. Okay. Oh! Ah, oh, oh, there we go. Nice critical hit. A clean one hit. And we're just gonna do some potions up here, if I recall. I haven't played it. Uh oh, he's getting. Now he's. Advantage. Whoa! Okay, I feel like if the game the wild Pokemon are critting a lot more than they should. No. Oh, oh my god, what the fuck? What? What is wrong with you? the Pokemon die. Why did it just like that? Home protecting the exhausted Pokemon. And I wasted potion my potions on that too. But you know what? I'm not taking them back. Screw that. I messed up, I messed up. So what we're gonna do. Hello my enemy. Eat scratch. Get scratch. He's gonna hit me for one big hit here in a second. Oh, he took one too many turns. Okay. Now with a, an extra level under my belt. My god, though, did I actually just faint out? That that was quite everything like that quick. That was that was atrocious. That was embarrassing, and I feel that was bad and I feel bad about it. Okay, a potion. Huh, I only spent two getting there. Oh, Sentry. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll beat you. I'll probably beat you. Give me XP. Uh, oh my god. This is why I'm using the speed thing, by the way, to make the game go faster. This, uh, this is only two and a half times faster. Can you imagine this? Two and a half times the amount of time spent on me just trying to get to the next town. Oh my god. Oh, oh, seeking the ancient archives of Indota's instant metabolism. Oops, eat the barrier with gain health. Well, I can do that too. Foreign berry, yeah. Alrighty, so. This is. This is Cherry Grove City, right? Yeah, it is. I forget the names of places. Hello! Can't experience from battle? Okay, you're just the basic information people. So you there, sir. Rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell, okay. So this guy gives you the basic tour, obviously. He tells you just the things around the town and the basic necessary things you have. 
A town map. Okay. Yeah, okay, so it did give us a town map. We're actually gonna take one... Oh. Okay. Map does not work. That was the map of the... of... 1, 2, and 3 island in Pokemon Fire Red? Of the seven of the Sevi Islands? Like... Yeah. That's the thing with fan hacks, I guess. Mystery Egg, okay, I've got the Mystery Egg and I'm going to get the Pokedex from Professor Oak. Okay, just thought I'm going to put... Uh, yeah, there's the call. So... It's already broken into the Pokemon. Alright. I was waiting for you, you red-haired freak. Let's do this thing. Let's do this thing. I like your sprite. It's a bit pixelated, but I mean, it is a sprite. And it was done by hand. So, there's Chikorita. Not afraid of it. Three levels and a potion on it. I should have actually picked up some more potions. Yeah, see, look at the damage difference. Forgot this is second gen, where you're always, always over leveled. Comparatively. Well, kinda. By the end, I'll be a bit over level because you should never be you should never be able to go through the Elite Four and, and get to like the third member before their Pokemon match your levels. But oh well. Oh, that's another actually one the final probably the final drawback on playing a uh, a fan hack of third gen is that it's not 100 percent complete. So apparently, you can only beat the first three gym leaders of of uh, the Kanto region. Like, you can beat the Johto League and all the stuff up to the credits, but after that, the, uh, the Kanto region, you can only beat three gym leaders before, the, like, the game's over, because the rest of the stuff hasn't been coded. Which kind of sucks. World 3's Pokemon Trainer. Ah, oh, He said his name. Mm, damn it! For any of you who didn't catch that, he just at the end, I guess, said, he saw him, I saw him say, my name is Zell. So, I named I named the thing at the beginning in the opening credits when it prompted you to name your rival. I put in the name Zell because I assumed that that was just leftover stuff from when it was Fire Red, and that you would still get to name your rival in here. Like, right here. I don't know if I'm still in here. It's giving me basic information from this realm. Yeah, so I assumed, because I, so I put in just the, the, one of the generic names it suggested because I had a good name for him. Oh yeah, I was gonna name him Tobias after that one just douchebag from the Pokemon and from the fourth gen Pokemon anime who pulled two legendary Pokemon literally out of his ass, and that was how the writers kept Ash from winning that season. The young man with long red hair. What you battled him? Oh dang, my last hope gone. So yeah, Zell. When I should have named him Tobias. Tobias has foiled me once again. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. This guy complained about there being a robbery. I was here when the Pokeball disappeared. So, does Zell have teleportation powers? He just, the ball kind of disappeared. And he was over there through the wall. Oh my god. Zell is a psychic. Uh, Mr. Egg, do you know? Yes, I have Pokedex. Okay, you received Pokeballs from this guy who doesn't again get out of your way because coding in Denhack. Um, go over here, talk to mom. Huh! 
that's interesting. Rather than code in a mechanic, the mechanic where your mother saves money for you, she actually just gives you an amulet coin, which increases money if it's the first uh, uh, held by the first Pokemon in your party. Okay, I'm game. No, I don't want. I don't need a tutorial on catching these guys. I've been doing this crap since I was like eight. Which you wouldn't know by that earlier, that Totodile whiteout earlier, which apparently I got mugged by a wild Rattata for, like, 98 polka dollars. Centred. Do I want to send- no, you know what? I'm gonna hold out for a decent level Rattata. Pidgey, do I want a Pidgey? I really don't, because I know exactly where I can get something else that does your job. 46. Up here there should be Spearow. Okay, good. A Rattata, because I wanted, actually wanted one of you. People underestimate Rattata. Rattatas are actually really good glass cannons. They're, they're, they can't take a hit worth their life, but they gain some high-powered moves early on, and they all have safe the attack bonus from being the same type as it, and it has really good speed and physical attack, like decent speed and physical attack, so no, will not nickname you. Um, on a Geodude. Yeah. Oh. Right. It's a Geodude. Uh, come on, man. Hit me. Make the rage more powerful. Oh, my God. This is like an abusive father-son relationship. I'm just kind of raging and he's curled up to the ball. Oh, oh, my rage. Oh, oh, he fought back. Now my rage is building. Your fucking took my job. So now I'm now I'm on this build. Oh okay. okay, that will hold the new here. Yeah, alright, you do, you're in my party. I don't shit. Oh, that's weird. No. As I did say, the fan hack thing, they did alter what Pokemon appear where a little bit.